recording. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. Spirit, Amen. Come, Holy Spirit, fill the hearts of your faithful and enkindle in them the fire of your love. Send forth your spirit, and they shall be created, and you shall renew the face of the earth. O God, who by the light of the Holy Spirit instructs the hearts of the faithful, grant us by the same Holy Spirit to be truly wise and always to rejoice in his consolation through Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Matthew. Glory to you, O Lord. Glory to you, O Lord. As Jesus passed by, two blind men followed him, crying out, Son of David, have pity on us. When he entered the house, the blind men approached him, and Jesus said to them, Do you believe that I can do this? Yes, Lord, he said to them. Then he touched their eyes and said, Let it be done for you according to your faith. And their eyes were opened. Jesus warned them sternly. See that no one knows about this. But they went out and spread word of him through all that land. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Tita Lane, please go ahead with these three pointers. These three pointers for today's Gospel. Number one. Our Lord can and will perform miracles and wonders for us if we only have stronger faith in Him. That was precisely why Jesus showed mercy to the two blind men when He healed them of their blindness. Number two, are there areas of blindness in the way I live my Christian life? An example, my pride, lack of concern, impatience, and lack of respect and for others, etc. Number three, the blind men who were cured proclaim Jesus' power for all to hear. Do I feel just as energetic and enthusiastic in proclaiming what Christ has done for me? Why? Amen. 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 Thank you very much, Tita Lynn. Well, the gospel is short, no? It is about the two blind men again. Just like Bartimaeus. And the thing here is that Jesus asked them. You know? He did not heal them outright, but he asked them, do you believe that I can do this? He was somewhat extracting from them if they have faith, because it's very vital now if you have that you have faith, or else there will be no healing. No healing that will occur if you don't have that faith. But surely, these two blind men approached Jesus, knowing that he can heal, and. In that alone, we can see somehow they have uh, some level of faith. And when Jesus saw that they have that faith, he was able to heal them. You know? Again, nowhere in the in the gospel in the Bible no, that Jesus will say, in a, "Go, I have healed you." No, it's always faith. Go, your faith has has uh, saved you. Saved you. See, laging ganon eh. Wala kang babasa sa Biblia na. Pinagaling na kita, humayo ka na. No. It's always faith. Kasi walang magaganap na healing. Kung wala kang pananampalataya, hindi. Surely, you would not approach some, somebody or anybody. 
you do not faith, you, you do not have that faith that that person can cure you. Uh -huh. And uh, we apply this to ourselves. Kagaya nga yung binasa ni Tita Linda na three pointers. Most of us are blind also. Maybe not physically blind, but uh, interiorly or spiritually blind. Na hindi natin makita yung sarili natin because to see our uh, the areas in our blindness we have to approach, approach the light we want and jesus is the light there in in front of jesus we can see a uh, mga pride natin mga sinfulness, sinful inclinations natin, mga kahinaan natin. And in front of Jesus, we are nothing. And only Jesus can heal our blindness. We'll just have, we just have to have that faith to approach him. Ask for healing. And when we are healed, there's always that uh, offer of salvation. Magkaakibat yan, eh, no? When he heals somebody, when he heals you, he offers you salvation. Go, sin no more. Parang ganun. But some of us, when, when we are healed, yeah. we uh, usually go to our usual uh, mga gawain. No? Yeah. Wala tayong parang utang na loob, ika nga. And in this uh, Advent season, this is a time now. No? Sabi ni Padre Dani na the Advent of Christ in his first coming, no? the Advent season. We prepare. And more importantly, is we prepare also for the second coming, which we do not know. Could come to us personally, in person, personally, or at the end of the age. Just like uh, Father Bong, no? he never knew that it's coming. I remember him. Yeah. I remember him um, frequently saying mass at our uh, chapel before. It was still a chapel. No? It was tall, lean, no? Medio yeah. yeah. And maybe I don't recall if he said masses as a guest priest when uh, our 
chapel was already a, a big church. Ano anong church yun Tito Mans? As holy. Reception. That's why we are having our novena, no? Nagumpisa na nung November 29 up to December 7. And December 8 is our uh, fiesta. Uh, fiesta, no? Uh -huh. Yeah, maybe I'll Maculate. not be around December 8. Immaculate Conception. Maculate and the uh, closing of the Jubilee door. door no? Because that we celebrate uh, the 25th anniversary of our church from chapel to a parish church, 25 years. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we are, I, we are be a little bit busy. Naga, uh -oh. nag celebration. Online, no? Sa Immaculate Conception. Yeah. Immaculate Conception. Mm -hmm. December 8th. Maybe uh -huh. uh, December 8th, I'll be here. You, you won't be around. You won't be around. I'll be there. I will attend the uh, procession. Bishop will be officiating uh, the, uh, the mass. Yun ang chapel, yun ang chapel na tinulungan ni Tito Elmer, no? Yun ba? No, no, no. Yan tinulungan ni Brother Elmer yung Most Holy Rosary Parish. Yeah, Most Holy Rosary. Oh, oh. We are uh, also uh, contributed <coughs> some the, no? uh -huh. the erection of that uh, church. Tumulong din kami as a chapel. <coughs> So my personal and my father bone. Maging parish, doon kami nagsisimba. Doon mm -hmm. ako nagsisir sa kuan. Most Holy Rosary. Sa, sa Most Holy Rosary. Uh, multinational. Pero nung naghiwalay na, we became a parish church kasi madami na kami. Right now, we are about uh, more than 40,000. No? Pero ilan-ilan lang yung sumisimba dyan, siguro mga 10%. Well, the others, maybe they go to other churches, hear mass, pero dito sa church namin, the most is mga 10%, mga 10 dollars. Mga ilan ang masses namin? Six, five? Five masses. Six masses. Six masses. Plus one mass on a Saturday, the anticipated mass. Six masses in all. Sa, sa, ano, sa whole week or every day? Uh, Sundays. Sundays. Sunday. Sunday. Six, eight, ten, five. On sa, five sa, on Sunday, five plus one anticipated six masses. Oh. Dito nga eh, hindi isang 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 misa lang hindi pa mapuno. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Well, uh, sa states, sabi nila, mostly mga Baptist. Matatanda. Matatanda. Oh, Baptist sila. Oh. Oh, kara, ano bang... Maraming mga church dito na hindi hindi Catholic ba? Mga non-denominational. Denominational. Uh, Do, doon sila nagasimba. So anyway, yeah. So, Father Bong is a good example, no? About about yes, be yes. prepared, no? about be prepared, no? Because look what happened, no? Nobody's exempted. Ano man ang swerte. Yeah. 
And then, uh, according to the gospel ngayon, is your faith have saved you. Yun talaga ang ano ni Jesus. Pero, pero there's a, uh, I have one question, no? kung bakit, uh, kung bakit ayaw pa ni Jesus na i, ano, na i, i, uh, yung sinabi niya, again, warning, not really warning, sinabihan niya ang dalawang blind men na don't tell anybody yet. Because it's not his time yet, no, siguro. Ayun ang sa Bible interpretation, yun ang sinasabi nila na it's not it just time. Not... But because the people won't believe. Hindi maniniwala yung mga tao eh. Oh. Maniniwala yung, even with the miracles, many still uh, oh. try to kill him. You know? Not all Jews are against him. Marami rin naniniwala sa kanyang mga audio. Pero marami ang hindi naniniwala. Mas marami, o. Oh. Mas marami. Because of pride, no? Mm. Because of their pride. Oh. Pero talking about about the healing of these two blind men, no? Um, uh, Jesus Jesus has has found them, had found them siguro with, with tremendous faith. Kaya, kaya he, during that time, ginheal niya ang dalawang blind men. Tapos yun, yun nga ang, ang na-mention mo, Tito Manny, na yeah, your, faith have, your faith has healed you. Yun palagi. Uh, so that means now with God, nothing is impossible. Yes. Just have, the, yeah, just have the, the, the correct amount of faith. faith lang. The strength of faith that is needed. Because yun nga ang mga sinasabi na uh, faith, uh, your faith can move mountains, uh, your faith um, can heal you, nothing is impossible with God, mga ganyan ba? Because the healing is really, it depends on your faith talaga. Kung wala kang faith, paano ka ma-heal? Yeah, faith. Uh -huh. Sabi uh -huh. nga, faith can move mountains. Uh -huh. Because... Meaning, uh, moving a mountain is something impossible. So with faith, uh, possible nothing. becomes possible. Yeah. Oh. Siguro in this point, uh, in, uh, in this point in time, siguro no. Uh, if we look back. If we look back, no, marami tayo siguro mga events and experience in life na because of our faith, ba? It became nothing. Nothing is impossible because of our faith. It's it's if not only healing, it's uh, something na na what you ask for is not na materialized. Kahit na uh, it's during the time you you think that it was uh, impossible, impossible either healing or or mga mga answered prayers ba at this point in time sa life natin. Oh, mar marami na oh, marami na and ah uh, uh, yun ang sabi mo tito mani no na baka kulang pa ang ano natin ang pasalamat natin. <laughs> Kung minsan isa pagkatapos na heal na wala na back to old uh, habit na. Oh. Old habit na. So But the, the odd, it, it's the order it should not be the case no. Mm -hmm. Given those uh, trials no. Hard mga pagsubok. Uh -oh. Those are meant to strengthen us, to strengthen, strengthen our faith. Uh -oh. Dapat lumago yung pananampalataya natin to make us strong. Because uh -oh. those trials could either destroy us or strengthen us. Uh -oh. Yeah, it's true. If you give up, then you will be destroyed. But if you keep on fighting, your faith will, will be will grow. It will become strong. Sabi nga nila, trials will make you strong. Lumalakas ka. Hmm? Nagbibigay ng lakas. You become a stronger person. A better person. Because of the realization. 
binibigyan tayo ng problema, binibigyan tayo ng mga uh, adversities. So, hmm? Oo. Mga trials, um, ano, ginatry ang faith. So, dito lang sa atin is we are a small group pero lahat tayo is naki-experience how how faith have healed you or have uh, na, 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 na ano na granted ang prayers because of your faith so ay isang good example niyan is ang kay Tita Flor na kwan it happened recently lang ang kay Tita Flor di ba Tita Flor na yes, na Oh, na after 16 years na dakip ang criminal the last of the group who destroyed and and uh, like and no sas destroyed your your family yeah yeah so after 16 years of praying and uh, persevering yun ang good example of patience and perseverance and faith kay tita that waver uh -oh. no that waver uh -oh. uh -oh. uh -oh. You're hindi a good surrender. <laughs> hindi ka nag-surrender, ho? Ay, hindi. Oo. So, imagine 16 years after. So, may mga personal experiences tayo na because of our faith, we are healed. Because of our our faith, ang mga, mga prayers natin answered na during that time, we thought it was impossible, pero possible pala. So, marami, talagang marami. Oo. No? So just remember no na because of those uh, uh, healing because of these uh, favors uh, granted no na na ano na although we are we are sinners we are not worthy uh, uh, we are not worthy of all these uh, blessings but because because God is so good and so merciful and he, and his love for us is, is unconditional yung granted ang ang prayers natin is uh, uh, ano are granted and uh, also because of our faith. Totoo yan, Tito. Oh, imagine <clears throat> two blind men. Siguro magkaibigan sila siguro, no? Or maybe they know each other, no? They knew each other. Itong, itong two blind men. Bakit sabay sila nag... Bakit sabay sila nag... Ano, nag uh, they look for Jesus. And... Siguro and silang may faith. Oh, Magkumpari oh, sila siguro. Magkumpari <laughs> sila siguro. Siyempre. <laughs> so, <laughs> kaya lang because of, uh, because of uh, so much uh, happiness and gratitude and everything, siguro they, they couldn't help themselves but really tell or told their stories sa ibang tao even though nagin gin, sinabihan na sila ni Jesus na don't, don't tell anybody yet no so yeah. from grateful heart from grateful hearts mm -hmm. pero mangyari sa iyo yan hindi ka rin makakapigil eh hindi mo rin mapipigilan yeah oo oh, oh. maski sabihan ka wag mong isabi sa iba the more na sasabihin mo <laughs> <laughs> Tapos marami mga bulag nagpunta siguro pag may uh -oh. <laughs> uh -oh. <laughs> siguro nagsa ang mga bulag uh -oh. kag mga ano <laughs> oh. oh yun naman ang nangyari kasi yung mga uh -oh. mga narinig nila um, yun mga, mga narinig nila they heard about about this healer na si Jesus nga so because of their faith no they were looking for him they looked for him really just like dito sa atin sa modern life natin no may pare na na marunong mag uh, marunong mag-heal or famous na, na nagaheal oh punta sila ako noon nung nandiyan pa ako sa Iloilo kung marinig ko na si Father Salcedo eh, or sinong pare diyan na taga Manila na darating na um, na famous for healing kahit na wala akong sakit puntahan ko punta ako mag-attend ako sarado ang clinic <laughs> Father Suarez. Yan, yeah, Father Suarez. So si Father Suarez sa uh, ano. Uh, hindi ko na ano, hindi ko na abutan si Father Suarez. Grabe siya, healer. Oh, healer siya no. Mm -hmm. uh, ano talaga immediate healing. Makita mo talaga. Wow. Oh my god, wow. Mm -hmm. Sayang no. 
Mm, na heart attack nun siya. Na heart attack siya. Mm. While playing so, tennis. Playing tennis. So, mm. so, so yun ang mga example sa modern life natin na kung saan natin marinig na may pupunta na pari or hili, puntahan natin kaagad. Mm. Faith natin yan. Faith natin. Oo. So, itong mga biblical stories, no? mga uh, stories during those times, no? ito ngayon sa modern life natin, it's still, it's still going on. Mm-hmm. So, um, during those times, kaya lang wala, walang social media, during those times, yung mga, mga ano lang, nakikinig lang, uh, uh, good, mm-hmm. word of mouth lang. Mm-hmm. O tapos talagang hahanapin nila si Jesus. Oo. Pero uh, here we don't have to look for Jesus because Jesus is here with us. In our hearts. So, in our hearts, in the Blessed Sacrament, He is really, really present. He is really present. As prayer warriors, we should also have to pray for others. Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Hindi lang bulag na mata na bulag. <laughs> bulag bulagan. Oh, nagpabulag-bulagan. Oh. And because of those of this pabulag-bulagan lang we we are so blinded na. Oh, Mar- marami ho. Oh. Marami tayong nakikita. Not not only. Not only sila sa atin din na um, blind tayo sa in one way. In one way. One way or another ba. Nagiging blind tayo. Blind tayo sa needs of others. Not really blind na blind, pero sometimes kulang ba? Kulang ang attention natin. Okay. Okay. Ganyan ba? Ho? Kulang ang time natin, kulang ang arms giving natin, kulang ang prayers natin. Yun, par- partially blind lang tayo. <laughs> May pag-asa pa. <laughs> May pag-asa. <laughs> Oh. Oh. The first panel of Advent hope. is hope. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, may something to add, Katita Bells? Wala na. Uh, oh, maganda ang ano natin. Ang Tonight ang sharing. Uh, so, we we mentioned um, ano, Father Bong. And um, Yeah, I was able to attend the ano ako din, the, ho, mass, ho, ho. the mass ho. The mass ho. Yung naka wheelchair no, parents niya. Mother pa- siguro no. Pa- mother mother. Pa- siguro. Mm. No? Mm. So, kawawa naman pero anyway, tapos ng ang mission ni Father Bong kasi. Mission ni Father. Ah, uh, mission niya sa dito sa mundo is uh, tapos na. Mm. So anybody else na may dagdag kayo na about uh, ano uh, your faith has saved you or ha- has healed you anybody uh, So so like like the like uh, ano uh, just make sure na whatever miracle or healing or favors that that are granted no sa atin no let's keep on let's let's continue and keep on um uh, praising him as a sign of gratitude no? kasi nga ang ang ano may mga example tayo dito in a, na na humingi ng prayers tapos sa uh, Uh, may problema tapos nung wala na na relieve na hindi na nag-attend nag-in active na so <laughs> i'm not kasi, i'm not pointing fingers no pero din sa, kasi sa nabigay na ng lives na tanabi oh. si sa concerns of their lives ha oh, oh, oh. mm-hmm. wag naman ganyan no pero alam mo ba tita talagang kun Malakas ang faith mo, no? Kagaya ako. Na nag-apply ako sa PILDT. Ako lang ata ang pinakaprot-prot na universidad niya nakatapos. Lahat mga kabats ko, Ateneo di Dabao, Ateneo di ano, studios ko, ano ba ito? Ako, ako, University of Iloilo. Ganun sabi ko. Hindi naman, ho. Oh. Oh. Oo, tapos sige, sige ang ano. Mamaya pagkasabi ng manager, bukas may exam. Mm. Alam mo, nagpunta ako sa may San Pedro Church, tita. Lahat nga mas santos, dami-dami santos doon. Pinangkalabit ko yan lahat. 
<laughs> Tapos, nang kinalabit ko lahat, sabi ko, Diyos ko, sana makapasa ako, ganito, ganito. ganito. Alam mo, nag number one pa ako sa exam. Uh-huh. Wow. Oh, kasi, <laughs> kaya nga sa... <laughs> a faith mo. <laughs> Oo, oh, sala. Sabi oh. ko, ay San Pedro. Huwag mo iitin yung University of Iloilo mo. Oo, oh, oh, wag mo i-ano. <laughs> it depends on the estudyante. Oo, oh, oh, tapos <laughs> doon. Sabi ko, Ganon rin tita nang nag-graduate ako ng high school. Siyempre, ang section ko, Laurel, ang pinaka hindi ma-bright na section ba? Ang mga bright na mga Rizal section, ganon ganon Sabi ko, Diyos ko, paano kaya ito? Kailangan matap ko ito ang exam para ma-well known man ako ba? Kasi siyempre, galing ng ilo-ilo, parang, parang ano ba? Ang mga tao sa Mindanao, sa, sa University of Mindanao, parang Ginaw galait-lait. Ginalait-lait ka ba? Ito na. Nag, nang nag-exam kami sa physics. Natap ko rin ang physics. Alam mo, lahat ng mga estudyante sa Rizal Siksyon nagpunta sa amin nga Siksyon. Uy, saan ba yan si Kamagan? Saan ba yan si Kamagan? Sabi niya, ikaw ko, ako, bakit? Hindi sila maniwala. Hindi sila maniwala ang natap ko. Alam mo ba anong ginawa? Ginpasold pa ko sa blackboard na mga problem solving. Kasi oh. sa physics, mga problem, so, problem oh, solving, oh, di ba? Oo. Oh, oh, oh. yeah. Dasal naman ako, Lord. Dyan na hindi yeah. ako magkamali. Ah, mabuti naman, na-solve ko rin. Hindi ma, naman mano sa otak. Hindi naman wala sa otak ko ang mga solving problems na yun. Yun. <laughs> <clears throat> Basta dasal lang. O kaya nga, believe yun ako kapag magdasal ka nga, taim-tim ba? Hindi ibig yeah. sabihin nga magdasal ka parang gano'n-gano'n. Kailangan, kung pwede pa, sa harap mo na si Jesus eh. Mm-hmm. Oh, ha. Ako magdasal. Diyos ko patawala. It's true. Strong ang faith mo, Tita Flor. Oo. Oh, oh. Tapos, uh-huh. pusang una, maldita ako. Pusang. <laughs> Maldi-maldita ako ng unong-una, di ba? Tapos, <laughs> Ay, naku, napaka-maldita ni Tita Flor noon. Tapos, <laughs> maryo siya. <laughs> Hindi, nagapamugno. Nasa drogery ko. Oh, <laughs> sa pakilit ito ako. Oo. Noon niya. Yeah. <laughs> tapos yun. Naku, tapos yung kasalanan ko pa rin nga sa Dabao, tita, na ano, na yung may narinig ako nga naga, ano ba, palagi nakapabuntot-buntot sa asawa ko. Sinapak ko talaga yun sa mukha. <laughs> Wala yeah, tanong tanong. Hindi ko makalimutan, tita Flor. Yung sinapak mo ang girl. Ito na flor, hindi yan face. <laughs> hindi yan face, maldita. Hindi, <laughs> hindi yan. <laughs> Fighting for her rights. Oo, oh, oh, kaya nga sabi ko, I will fight for, sabi ko, eh bakit naman? Pukunin mo akin yan eh. <laughs> yun, Tapos, pinagsisihan ko rin yun. Pinagsisihan ko rin. <laughs> Pero yung mga miracle, tita nga, hindi ko pa rin na, na makalimutan yung nahulog ako sa ng PILDITI. Parang sabi ko, ako ata ang indaga nito sa building nga, ano, nga inauguration. Nahulog ako, tita. Alam mo ba, nagkaroon ako ng blood clot sa brain. Tapos oh. nagkasal ako. Oo. Oh, oh, wow. Si Toto noon, si Toto daw seven months pa lang. Seven oh. months kasi March yun eh. Tapos sabi ko, Lord, huwag mo muna ako kunin. At saka, kung pwede lang, kunti lang makita sa angiogram yung clot ba. Tapos kinausap ko rin ang surgeon nga. Sabi ko, maawa ka, huwag mo kooperahan. Sabi ko sa kanya, maliit pang anak ko. Dasal naman ako nga dasal. Tita, alam mo, ang nag-pre-over sa akin yung mga madre sa Assumption. Mm-hmm. Sa Assumption Charles, nagpunta sa, nagpunta sa ano, nagpunta sa hospital. Kasi may kaibigan, may kaibigan kami na nagkatrabaho sa Assumption. So, pinuntahan ni Ed yan. Nag-ano sa mga Madrid doon. Tapos, gin pre over ako. Na makita sa angiogram, tita, maliit lang ang ano, maliit ng clap. Uh-huh. So, hindi ako na-operahan. Oh, hindi ka na-operahan. So, natunaw hindi na lang yun. Nat- natunaw uh-huh. lang yun. Uh-huh. Tapos, si, tapos sabi nila, uy, alam mo ba, si Dr. Abundo, siya ang pinaka, yeah, siya ang ano, isang, the only surgeon sa Mindanao sa mga gano'n sa ulo ba? Oo, oh, neurosurgeon. Kinausap ko siya. Kinausap ko, Dok. Sabi ko, uh, bago ko kausapin, nagdasal mo na ako. Kung hindi naman kailangan ng operahan, wag na. Sabi ko sa kanya. 
sabi niya, tingnan natin. Eh, alam mo naman mga mga oh, ganun oh. doon. So, alam nila nga company bayad. Malaki ang bill nila yan. Hmm. So, ba na huli? Sabi ko, mawa ka seven months pa lang anak kong bunso. Mm-hmm. Biro mo, tita, 60 days ako sa hospital noon. Di ako makawa wow. ng tubig. Nanginginig ako. Pag makaaroon ako ng tubig, nanginginig ako. Yun. Oh. Tapos 60 days ako 60 sa hospital. 60 days, no? Two months, no? Two months ako doon. Two months ka sa hospital because of nahulog ka. Oo, nahulog ako sa agdan. Dok Pilaka steps you. Inagurish yun, tita. Pero alam mo, after three days, may namatay. Binangungot ang janitor doon sa sa building na yan. Kaya nga sabi ko, Diyos ko, ito mga dami-dami po naranasan ng <laughs> kasakitan, pero still alive pa rin. <laughs> yeah, and because of your tapos, strong faith. Oo, oh. tapos tita, marami rin ako operation. May appendicitis, may ovarian cyst, may hysterectomy, may cyst sa breast, may cyst din. Tapos may carpal tunnel pa sa dalawang kamay. Dami. Puro, puro ka slice pala. Oo. <laughs> dami. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Oo. Oo, dami. Pero, but, but, uh, pero pero look at you ngayon Tita Flor no mm-hmm. na, na nakapasa ka sa mga trials mo no? ay oo oo nakapasa ka sa mga oh nakapasa rin ako oo oh. 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 very Bilang. nice ko marami at saka marami pa rin matumaga ano ako sa sa mga dasal ko marami na papadasal sa akin yung mga may mga sakit may 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 may, may may ano, may mga mesis nga idasal ganito, ginadasal ko rin sila. Ang iba, di ko na ma-mention sa atin tita Bell, pero kuminsan sa pagkatapos niyan, ginaano ko rin, gina-mention ko rin sila lahat ang nagpapadasal. Oo. Alami. So, because of your trial, oh, tita Bell? Oo. Uh-huh. Sabi ko, Diyos ko, dami-daming, kwan? dami-daming, uh-huh. Ano, yung sa breast ko naman, dinasal ko rin yan. Kasi sabi nila, baka agad ito si A. Eh, ano, sabi ko, ay hindi. Hindi yan. Tapos, uh, nang ginoperahan ako, dalawang bisis, gin pa, gin pa autopsy sa may... No, sa, biopsy. Sa, ano, gin pa biopsy, biopsy sila sa may... Sa UST, kung saan-saan pa gin pa biopsy. Mabuti normal naman, negative. Uh-huh. Negative siya. So ang ang healing ang healing mo Tita Floro because of your trials and because of your faith no spiritual healing naging mm-hmm. the more na nag stronger ang faith mo hindi lang Dama. physical Dama. Oh. Oh, hindi oh, lang oh. physical healing hindi spiritual healing pa spiritual oo oh. So if you th- if you think about about your life no oh, sandali lang ha ma- 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 uh, three minutes lang if you think about your life you're a good example Tita Floro no na Parang binigyan ka muna ng, ng a little bit of here and there ng mga trials ba. Mm-hmm. And then ginatestingan ang faith mo. And then binigyan ka ng pinakamalaki na ano, pinakamalaki na trial yung nawala ang nawala ang anak mo. Kinuha oh. ang anak mo. So that means na parang para nabaid ka na ba sa mga trials oh, in life oh. na ano before ka ginanuhan ng malaki na malaki ano Oo, pero alam before mo, kami diga ng malaki Oo. nang nawala si Bunso alam mo ba nag-attempt ako mag-suicide mm-hmm. sabi ko mag magano ako pero nag nagtrabaho pa rin ako sabi ko ah hindi pwede nga sa bahay lang nag-apply ako doon sa hindi makati siyang rela may edad na ko kung natanggap pa ako doon interview interview nang gin pa na kami sa kan sabi ko ay ano kaya kung mag mag-job ako dito sa pinakamataas nga ano ba? Nga building. Doon sa pinakatap ng Makati Shangri-La, eh harap, ang harap ng Makati Shangri-La, PLDT. A week before, may isang empleyado sa PLDT nga nag, nag-jump din sa ano sa building. Sabi ko, ay, sabi ko, ano kaya? Ganun-ganun mo. May tinawag ako ng manager. Sabi niya, uh, ate, mali ka na. Sabi niya, yun, nag-ano ako. Pero nag, talagang nag-ano ako. Ah. Sabi ko, sabi ko nga, suicidal kaya, attempt ka pala sana. Oo. Oh, oh. Tapos naman ang huli, sabi ko, ay, 
si Tuto nga siguro na guide sa akin nito makapasok ako sa Shangri-La eh. Bakit naman? Da- bakit gawin ko? Hindi ganun ko niya ang sarili. Oh. Grabe sa yun. Sa depression. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, oh. Sa depression. Oo, tapos nang oh, oh. doon sa Shangri-La, alam mo ba? Every first Friday, sa Sunday, ano, ako ang nag-assist doon sa mass. Ako nag-assist mm-hmm. doon sa mass nila every every may mass doon. Three times a week. Mm-mm. Ako nag-assist uh-huh. sa pari. O mag, ano, ng, mag-prepare ng mass, ganun. Uh-huh. Oh. May mission ka pa, Tita Flor. Oo, oh, oh, yun. Uh-huh. Na, uh-huh. May mission ka pa. Oh, nakastidin ako ng four years doon sa Makati Shangri-La after ng PLDT. Oh. Tapos hindi ka hindi ka na nag-attempt na uh, hindi ka na mag-attempt na mag maghulog sa building. Ay, hindi na. Wala na. Oo. <laughs> Ginasikaso ko na lang tita ang ano yung yung court hearing. Oh. Sabi ko kawawa naman pag pag wala ako wala maasikaso. Oh. That's that was a good decision and guided decision. Mm-hmm. Oh. Oh. Thank you Tita Flor. Very nice sharing oh, oh. about your faith. So, anybody else before we go to ano closing prayers? Kung may kayo jan kung may ilagdag kayo about faith. So, please go ahead, uh, Tita Belen. Yeah. Okay, closing prayer. Lord, we come before you today humbly acknowledging our need for you. We thank you for your never-ending patience despite our many flaws and fumbles. Lord, we ask that you guide us to seek you to seek you out each day. Lord, may your loving hand direct our steps as we go out into the world every day. In Jesus' name, we ask these things. Amen. 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 And glory be to the Father, to the Son, to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you all. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, Peter Thank you, everybody. Bye.